<clears throat> Alright, I'm back from college and it's time to unbox 2023 Nissan uh, Fair Lady Z. Did I say that correctly? Now, they begin. There we go. A blue Nissan Fair Lady Z. Kong Focus. Kinda looks like a Jaguar, I'll tell you that. Anyways, thank you for watching, that's... No wait, the video isn't over. I can still go on. I did have tons of other cars I didn't show you guys, so... Why don't I do that? Obviously it's... I mean, you... Hold on. Got it. I've got some, not, not just a little, okay, I was lying, I got a lot. Alright, we'll begin with the Bugatti Chiron. I put Mario in there, if you couldn't see, there he is. See? Every single detail on the license plate and to the emblem. Lights, carbon fiber, everything. Oh, it's, oh, it's made by May stuff. If you can tell, it's literally, you know, written in carbon fiber. Hold on, let me feel this. Feel the emblem. Oh, almost, but not exactly. Oh, well. Now, let's see what I'm on. Oh, wait, yeah. The Corvette C7R. It's nice looking, but some of its paint's starting to wither away. This is actually my favorite race car right here, next to the Corvette C8R. Every detail has been gotten. Oh, except the mirrors. But, then again, you can only get so much detail without going overboard. I like the Bugatti Chiron, which I will showcase just in a bit. This car's doors open. Hat shoot. Yep. Oh, and did you not see? I did a video on this recently. The Red Bull... Red, okay, camera, if you're not gonna focus... There we go. It's a 1 in 43 car. One of my first ever ones. But... It looks more like a... 1 in 32 scale, if not everything is tiny. Oh, and this managed to come off the spoiler. It's the Red Bull Oracle RB... Hold on. Upside down again. RB uh eighteen. Yeah, the the R the Red Bull Racing Red Bull six at the Oracle Red Bull Racing RB eighteen twenty twenty two. Yeah. Like the tires, it's my favorite brand. P zero. Looks like F zero. You know that game. I can't believe I never showed this to you guys. Or have I? Here's a Bugatti Bull Eyed. Not only do its two doors open, but the rear and front <coughs> trunks and um, hoods open up. Oh, and that's a pullback. This company is actually made by a Chinese company. I mean, this car is made by a Chinese company. Titled X H something. If anybody knows what that is, maybe it's a K. X H K. Is that what that is? I have, I have absolutely no idea. 
Jacob and Company campaign. Yep, that's what's up. Alright. Here's the Maestos 2020 Chevrolet Corvette C8 Stingray. Oh, and side note. I'm gonna need to get used to it, which I don't think I will. I can't find it anywhere in my room. The third grill right there. No, not there. Here. Right, so it's like this, but mirrored. Can you tell the difference? At the same spot. Obviously, I'm just playing you like a fool. This thing has a cool gimmick. Let me open up the door first. And, um, well, once as I turn the steering wheel. Here, I'll give you a good one. If you can't see it, sorry. Hold on. There we go. Shoot. God, trying to crack this. No, not crack. Fixing this. So I gotta try and crack the puzzle. As to how the hell I'm supposed to beat Treasure Island 1 and Zack and Beaky. And, yes, I'm serious, I have that game. Sorry, I had to take a long intermission and fix it. But anyways, these wheels do turn. Like other cars that I have. Is it so smooth? It's hard for me to... Oh, I, I thought I scraped the paint off. For mine. Boom. Storage unit. You guys can't see? Oh, there it is. And here we have this. Can you store stuff here, too? By the way, I've yet to figure out this car's horsepower. Yep. And that license plate is actually a stick. Here's the next one. Oh, hold on. That's better. Here's a Bugatti Devo. And nice matte gray. I like. Let's get a good look. It's all light blue with carbon fiber. Oh, and there's a the dashboard. Oh, did I not forget to mention that these cars actually do have seat belts built into them? I mean, just look at this. Look at this. Little seat belt. Oh, this car does not have an opening trunk. It does have an opening um, hood. You can store stuff in there. Okay. However, I'd like to point out, this does move. Well, it moves as long as you know we put it back on. There we go. Hold on. Let me get a good view. There you go. Finally. But, never mind. Here it is. The Lamborghini V12 Vision Grand Turismo. You guys may or may not have been anticipating this. This is easily the nicest looking thing I have. No moving spoilers, just an opening trunk and opening hood. 
Oh, and I should probably point out that these wheels right here are very stiff when you try to charm. Hold on. Let's have a look inside. Yeah, it is dusty. Hold on. It's still dusty? Hold on. Alright, there's the seat. There's the seat belt. Harness. I use the pedals. Because they look like them. But they also look like they're easy to pop off. Oh, they are. Wait. Never mind, why am I? Oh, and there's the steering wheel. Try to keep it flat, but good lord, is that...